All right, guys. Um, see, a while back, when I was in school, when I was in high school, I used to work at McDonald's. I worked there for two weeks. A long time ago. Yet still, to this day, my mom still thinks I have an inside track on when the McRib's coming back. <laughs> Keys hit me, hit me up about this elusive sandwich. I have no idea when this thing's coming back, you know? She loves that thing. Nothing will make her happier than a McRib Christmas. She loves it. So I always a limited time with that thing. The McRib's a lot like a deadbeat dad. It comes around every once in a while to check in on you. <laughs> like, how you doing? You doing all right in school? You better keep them grades up, man. I'll be back in a year, maybe go see a movie or something. <laughs> and your mom hates him, like, damn it, McRib. <laughs> You're three months behind with the child support checks. You're dripping rib sauce all over my carpets. You cheap, boneless bastard. <laughs> the real reason it's only around for a limited time is because it tastes like doo-doo. It's the worst sandwich ever made. You can only keep it in your stomach for a limited time. I try to eat this stuff, I try to eat healthy. My girl, my girlfriend eats healthy. She's a big fan of that. She, uh, she actually woke up screaming this morning, uh, having a nightmare or something. But uh, apparently I, I move my legs around a lot when I sleep, and it's been a while since I cut my toenails, so uh, I sliced up her ankles pretty bad. It was, it was, it was pretty rough. It wasn't that bad, I, mean, I think she overreacted. She's like, oh my God, your feet are like swords. I say, hey, take it easy. She's so abusive with her words. It wasn't that bad. I mean, she did need stitches, but it wasn't like a serious gash. I admit it's not my first time slicing up some girl's ankles in the sheets. Not my first rodeo at all. But it was a test and she failed because she left me. She called me a gargoyle and broke up with me. She failed the toenail test. I keep Always trying to change me. Tell me, cut your nails. I'm trying to, if she loved me, she would have wore combat boots to bed, you know? And just accepted me for who I am and my long ass toenails.